Dear Kira, I couldn't stop loving you if I tried. God, my heart hurts just thinking about it. I cannot quantify my love for you. The words do not exist to describe it. It is so deep within me. You are a part of me, essential, permanent. Your name is forever inscribed upon my heart and soul. And that is exactly how I want it. I love you, Bright Eyes, and I will always love you. More than the number of thoughts in my head, grains of sand in the ocean, stars in the sky, or even for all many. I love you. Forever yours, Mitchell. I love being engaged to you, but it's time we, for real, tied the knot and got officially, fully, in all senses of the word, married. So I have a few things I want to thank you for. Thank you for helping me grow. I have done so many silly things for so many silly reasons. You helped me realize what's important and have taught me so much. We grow together and we encourage each other to grow separately. You help me be who I want to be and I like who I am so much better when I am with you. Thank you for being adventurous with me. You are so down to just go, even when flying by the seat of our pants a little bit. You take the leap into the unknown with me and I'm so much more confident doing it with you by my side. And most importantly, thank you for being you. Your strong opinions, your deadly sense of humor, the joy you take in such random little things, your consistency, your incredible intelligence, your overflowing kindness, and your love. You love so hard, I feel it in my soul every day. You're the most amazing person I've ever met. I feel so lucky that you chose me. Dear Mitchell, here it is. We're off to officially, finally, promise to love and cherish each other forever. It's the sort of thing that makes you think about where you've come from, where you are, and where this whole thing is going. In a lot of ways, we really aren't the same people we were, but in the ways that matter, in the ways that make me love you, you're the same. You still tell the same dumb dad jokes. You still make me smile every day. You still calm me down when I'm anxious and cheer me up when I'm sad. You're still the most determined and driven person I know with the power to take over the world if you decided to. And you're still so kind and good-hearted that I don't think that would even be a bad thing. Baruchim Habayim B'Shem Adonai, we welcome you. With this moment, your hopes are being fulfilled. This moment is a merging of two paths of life into one. You make me so happy. Me, and not just in the sense of happy, the temporary fleeting emotion, though you do make me happy in that way every day, but in the deep sense of contentment. Having found a partner who completes me and who makes me better, being with you makes me more me. So here's to us growing together, to this right now being the least we love each other for the rest of our lives, to getting better at being ourselves together, to a future where we grow and change, as I've said, not from a conifer to a deciduous tree, but from a little tree to a big one, to save in all the ways that count, but more stable and strong. Basically, I love you absurdly. I always will, no matter what. I promise to always be there for you. No matter what happens, sickness or health, for rich or for poor, in any scenario that has ever or will ever exist, you're the most important thing in my life, and I'm not going anywhere. I promise to always talk with you. We talk so much. It is the greatest strength in our relationship. But it doesn't ever really feel hard talking with you, even about the stuff that's not fun to talk about and I promise to keep those conversations going. I promise to always support you. You are such an amazing person and are so good at so many things. No matter what you choose, I so wholeheartedly believe in you. We'll have your back and we'll be your number one fan. I promise to always make time for you. You are the most important, so no matter what occurs in life, I will always have time for you. More than anything else though, I promise to always love you. In the presence of these witnesses, you have spoken words and performed rites that unite your lives. May your future be filled with health, happiness, love, and fulfillment. Woo! Wow.